turning now to a cold case from Miramar. In 2002, 15-year-old Farrah Carter was brutally murdered in her own home. And nearly 20 years later, police say they know who killed her. NBC6 reporter Laura Rodriguez is live in Miramar with the details. Laura. Well, Roxy, detectives say advancements in DNA technology in 2019 led to a crack in this case. Detectives believe Joseph Pollard murdered 15-year-old Farrah Carter in May 2002. Uh, she, Carter was found dead in her bedroom with multiple stab wounds. Carter's family does not know Pollard, and the motive remains unclear. But police say he is currently serving a life sentence for another case involving kidnapping, burglary, and robbery. According to detectives, Pollard has an extensive criminal history involving various accusations of violence toward women. Fara Carter's family says today is overwhelming and that they don't necessarily feel closure. For the detectives to come forward with this information, it's very pleasing in a sense, but it's still heartbreaking. And without her being here to see what her life would have been like, to see the children maybe that she would have. For 19 years, I haven't been able to get my life together. Everything's changed in my life. And right now, it's like the first day of the rest of my life right now. I'm and when questioned in prison, Pollard denied any involvement in the case. Police now asking if you know Pollard, if you had any involvement with him at all, any sort of relationship with him back in the early 2000s. They want to hear from you. They need more information in this case, and they really want to get down and figure out what the motive is here. And I have to say, I cover a lot of these unsolved crimes, and it's so fascinating and interesting to see that after nearly 20 years, a case like this is now closed, and really DNA technology is picking up every day. So there are a lot of people out there who may have not been caught, but essentially detectives saying your time will come. That's the very latest here from Miramar. I'm Laura Rodriguez, NBC6 News.